Hi everyone, this is another haul video, a very small haul, and then I'll be coming back for some projects that I've been working on recently. Um, today, uh, it was such a gorgeous day, so we went to one of our local stores, a local stamp store called The Queen's Inc., and I picked up a couple things. I picked up this hydrangea stamp from Hero Arts. I needed some more serious kind of stamps, and I thought this one fit the bill, and I love the size. You can see it's pretty big. I also picked up a Thinking of You stamp. I don't have any sentiments that are like that. This stamp is by um, Impression Obsession. And a Stampendous stamp, um, You're in My Thoughts and Prayers. Again, I just needed some sentiments that were different than Thank You and Happy Birthday and all of those kinds of things. And then I picked up one more stamp set while I was there. Um, a cling mount stamp from Hero Arts. This one has the two birds on it and the beautiful roses there on the side. And this one is called Two Birds, Three Images. So just a nice stamp set to use for some cards and things. While I was there, I always like to pick up um, some little incidental incidentals and things I find along the way. So I did pick up another Signo white pen can never have too many of those. I did pick up um, one of the, the Spica pens. I do have several colors of these, but I've been having a hard time um, trying to find the clear one. And this pen is really nice. It has clear ink and it lays down a little bit of sparkle over any color. It works beautifully over your Copics. Um, so I picked up, I have one of these and I picked up another one as a backup. I also picked up um, several sets of little tags. Um, I know I could die cut these, but I find it easier just to, to buy them. They're like $1.15 for a pack of 20, I believe it is. So I picked up two sets of those. It's really pretty. Cute little tags to put in the pockets, the pocket envelope I just bought. Little square set. Again, this was $1.50. These are two and a half by two and a half, I believe. And then these little price tag kind of uh, shape. And again, they were $1.50 for a set of 20 And I did pick up some score tape recently, um, which is different than the red line tape I've been using, and I really like it. But they also had this rubber stamp concepts tape there. I've never tried this before. Um, it looks very similar to the score tape, but it says that it is... Um, invisible um, and that you can't see it through vellum so I thought I might try this because although I don't use vellum lots I do use it sometimes on my cards. It looks very similar to the score tape. And then the last thing I got was they had some packages of um, ephemera there so I picked up two sets of some vintage dictionary paper. Um, and it's, I picked it up because I just really love the way it's aged. It's aged beautifully. Just nice, warm aging on there. And then, as my husband um, went to pick up our daughter from the mall, um, I actually got a surprise that's not scrapbooking related, but I thought I would share it with you anyway. He brought me back from one of my favorite jewelry stores, um, which is Brighton. They have a lot of really neat stainless steel jewelry. Um, and I'm starting a collection, I believe. So he picked me up these earrings with the double hoops. I love hoops. Um, so double hoops can are even better. And then he also picked me, picked up for me, this beautiful necklace. I love silver jewelry. And I love the shape of this. And I love circles as well. Circle jewelry, I don't know why, it just in really inspires me. It inspires me in my paper crafting as well, especially my scrapbooking. So that's it. Very small haul for today. I will be back with um, some record a recording on some projects that I've been working on recently um, to share with you. And until then, have a great day.